The Donkey Kong series is an amazing and often overlooked franchise in my opinion. The graphics, level design, characters are all so charming, but today I will take a look at the amazing music to come from the series. At this point, I've only played Donkey Kong Country 1, Donkey Kong Country 2, Diddy Kong Racing, and Donkey Kong Country Returns. So the next video will have songs from the other games in the series like Donkey Kong Country 3, Donkey Kong 64, and Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze. I just really wanted to make this video now because I wanted to put a spotlight on these absolutely amazing soundtracks. This is the classic song Simeon Segway that was remade for Donkey Kong Country Returns. But for this game, all of the overworlds received their own unique sound to them, and they all sound so catchy. I really like the beehive level type in Donkey Kong Country 2 because it's incredibly unique and it also has some neat gimmicks like clinging onto walls. However, the best thing about it is the music. It's very atmospheric and kind of creepy. I also think it is a very underrated Donkey Kong Country song. What's so amazing about this song is how it changes the instrument based on the character your icon is on. My favorite is either TT or Timber. This song has got to be one of the more iconic songs that come out of the Donkey Kong Country series. I think it deserves its reputation because it sounds so serene and peaceful. Definitely makes the water levels a lot more bearable. In my opinion, while I do like Donkey Kong Country Returns, I think it lacks an identity. I think it is mainly because it uses a lot of music from Donkey Kong Country 1, and the new songs they add really don't stand out, but Gear Gateway and the many versions of Mole Patrol are great exceptions. I love this song because of how fast paced it is without too many instruments blaring in your ears. I've also heard that they got rid of this one in the DS version, which is a sin against God in my opinion.
I remember when I first heard this song, I thought it was going to be Gangplank Galleon again, which is a good song. But then the drums started and it turned into this jazzy version of the song. I absolutely love it. It is also a song that is commonly tied to Ratley, who is the best animal buddy, hands down. And if you don't agree, unsubscribe. This is yet another atmospheric song. At least it starts with a lot of atmosphere, but the part that plays later is just so beautiful. Definitely one of my favorites from Donkey Kong Country 1. This song is a remake of Life in the Mines from the first Donkey Kong Country, but the sexy beat for these songs is so good, I swear. I'm honestly surprised that this song doesn't get more recognition. It has so much ambience and is so beautiful. I think of it as the aquatic ambience of Donkey Kong Country 2. This is just a very catchy and fun song. I had to put it on here. The factory levels in these games have the best music, I swear. The original is much more upbeat and gets you pumped, while the remake has much more ambience. This is probably my favorite song from Diddy Kong Racing. I love the futuristic sound in combination with the wonderful background track.
This is a very obvious one, but how could I not put it on this list? It's probably one of the greatest music pieces in gaming history, and one of my personal favorites, so of course I'm going to mention it. This isn't my favorite song in the series, but I have to applaud it for the amount of atmosphere it conveys. It's both soothing and terrifying at the same time, and I love it for that. <laughs> 